Hello! Today we're going to talk about subtraction. Subtraction is when we have something and something went away. So we start with a big number and then some go away and our number gets smaller. It's a little bit different than addition. So remember in subtraction, subtraction gets smaller, okay? So we have something, some went away, and it's smaller. There are some symbols we need to remember when we are looking at a subtraction problem. This symbol is the minus sign. It also means take away. This symbol is the equals symbol. It means have left. When we listen to story problems, a lot of times these are the words that you're going to hear. They give you the clue how to solve the problem. Today, we're not gonna do story problems, but we're going to look at problems that have pictures. And we're gonna figure out what we should do in order to show our work and solve the problem. So I have three snowmen. Hmm. I start with a big number. Remember, subtraction's going to get smaller. Well, the sun came out and one snowman melted. I put a big X on the snowman that went away. How many snowmen do I have left? That's right, I have two. When I look at this problem, I need to think, okay, how many snowmen did I start with? What was my big number? Three. So I'm going to write three. Now what happened? One melted. So I'm going to use my minus symbol one to show the one that melted or the one that went away. How many snowmen do I have left? Great, I have two. So my math problem, the equation, that's a big fancy name for the numbers, the number sentence is three minus one equals two. It's showing that I had three snowmen to start off with. One went away. Now I have two. When we subtract, we get smaller. You have a sheet to work on at home today. When you look at this sheet, you want to put X's on the ones that go away. So, hmm, I wonder how I'm going to solve the first one. The first one says four minus two equals, hmm, what should I do? I should put X's. Where am I going to put the X's? Right on the snowflakes. How many snowflakes get X's? Two snowflakes. So I'm going to put two X's to show that two went away. How many snowflakes are left? Great job, two are left. Four minus two equals two. Hmm. I'm going to go straight down and I can see that there are five penguins. Let's count them. One, two, three, four, five. The problem has the symbol. What does that symbol mean? Exactly. It means 
something's going to go away. We're going to take away one. How many penguins should I put an X on? Exactly. One penguin will have an X. How many penguins do I have left? Let's count them. One, two, three, four. So my answer is four. I had five. One went away. Now I have four left. Do you think that you can do this all by yourself? I know you can. Remember, subtraction gets smaller. S subtract, s s small. All right, stay warm.